Okay, what I'd like to do is talk about literals in Ruby. So start up a new IRB console. The first literal I'm going to introduce is integer literal. The integer literal is 42. Uh, here, that, that represents 42. Um, another integer could be 12 or uh, 24. All integers you represent exactly the number that you would expect. Uh, next kind of literal I want to introduce is a string. A string is a series of characters. Um, hello world. That's a string. Um, we delimit strings with uh, quotes, uh, so double quotes in general. Uh, single quotes are fine also, um, but we tend to use double quotes uh, for a reason that we'll see later in this um, series when we talk about interpolation. Uh, the third kind of literal I want to introduce is a floating point number. 3.14. Um, floating point numbers are represent you know, partial parts parts of a whole number. The fourth kind of literal I want to introduce is a Boolean literal. Boolean literals can be one of two values. They can be true or they can be false. It can't be anything else. So these are the four kinds of literals that um, it's important to know about. The next thing I want to do is show you some common mistakes that you could make um, when defining literals. Um, the first one would be um, a not an unclosed uh, string. So for example, if I start typing a string here and then I leave it without closing it, you see the IRB will very helpfully tell us um, actually we need to close that literal. Um, we need to close it with the same kind of opening delimiter. So in this case it was a double quote, so until I put a double quote in, it will um, continue to tack stuff onto here. You see that's included the new line character. Uh, we'll learn about exactly why this means new line in a later lecture. Um, and then a quote, and then another new line, and then the end of the string. So that's that literal. Um, the other thing you could do is you could, um, you could dot them in the wrong place. So for example, something like this. Um, this won't work because um, it's saying uh, you can only have one one uh, period in a uh, floating point number um, that won't parse correctly. So those are some types of literals um, that will not work for you, um, but we have seen some that do. So there's um, integers, strings, floating points, and booleans.